Nobody feeling it. What was I thinking? It's gonna get interesting. What's going on guys? Robinson DUP. It's been a while and I am doing my best to get back into the swing of YouTube. As you can tell by the title of this video, I have started using utilizing the small off program. Uh, it's specifically built for squats, but I've blended in uh, bench and deadlift still. But very quickly here, we're starting off with my training partner, Matt, starting off with our three by eights. And then you'll see me here starting off with front squats. Now, the reason I'm doing front squats instead of back squats is if you follow my other social media like Instagram, I've had issues with my right hip and my right knee. And the front squats are just allowing me to be more straight up and straight down, get my hips to open up better, and I'm actually able to hit depth a lot cleaner. Uh, it, the movement is just agreeing with me more. Now, will I get back to back squatting? Sure, eventually I probably will. But um, it's just not something that's agreeing with me at the moment. So I'm going to try to run this whole 13-week block um, just doing front squats. Should be challenging. Now, here's Matt once again. Look at that booty, ladies and gentlemen. This is our 1x5 here that he's doing. And I don't know if you know how small off works, but at least in the intro week, you're doing different rep ranges and different percentages of your one rep max within the same day on certain days. Um, so that's what we're following here. This was actually the second day where we were working on um, this phase, as they say. So it's a little rough in the beginning. Uh, we are squatting anywhere from three to four times a week according to this program over the next 13 weeks. Now, see here, I'm getting nice and deep. I am way more uh, straight up and straight down than I am when I'm back squatting. I do have a little tendency to hitch to my right, but a lot of that has to do with the fact that due to my knee injuries to my left knee, uh, I did lose some range of mobility there, uh, which will not come back, unfortunately. Um, I've worked with a lot of physical therapists. It's just gone from all the kneecap dislocations. So moving on, I believe this is the two by two um, that we're now hitting. Yep, that should be it. Matt moved this nice and smooth. Uh, he was having some lower back issues, but everything went well. There's my ugly mug. Sorry, ladies and gentlemen, there's no amount of working out that's going to fix that. But once again, uh, really focusing on trying to stay straight up, straight down, and hit depth. Um, it's just a much more comfortable motion for me right now doing front squats. That was easy. So now the last part of this workout is one heavy single um so this is matt hitting his and he'll actually show off and pause at the bottom nice and easy followed by my last single this is about 250 pounds that i do for a single uh, i hope you enjoyed me showing you the squat part of the workout there were deadlifts and um, i did five sets of 10 of lat pull downs at the end of this workout however my training partner had to run as we were running a little late so I did not show that on video. Um, if you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, give it a thumbs down. But please subscribe, and I will talk to you guys soon. Thanks a lot.